Excuse me, excuse me, uh, passports? Passports, immigration. This ain't your mama's travel show. Uh, do you have maybe a sock I could stuff in here? This is entertainment for the next generation. The travel generation. I'm the ambassador of Strasbourg. I'm here to help any wayward visitor that may seem lost, dazed, or confused. Our premise is simple. Get out and go global. Travel's cheap. Memories are priceless. So pack a sack and make some. It's more than just a great Kodak moment. It's a symbol of freedom. The Brandenburg Gate represents the reunification of the East and the West of Berlin. And I'll tell you something, it's a great starting point as you work your way to this incredible city. We'll show you where to go, how to get there, best places to stay, and how to do it on a budget. For uh, 30 crowns, you can get like a full glass of beer. Jeff Scott does the legwork, so you don't have to. He's your local guide on an international adventure, spreading goodwill and harmony wherever he goes. Is your dad a baker? Because you've got a nice set of buns. Can I ring your bell? Would you like a bite of my apple? On the count of three, we're going to do low-cost bungee jumping, okay? It's only one bounce. You better enjoy the bounce. More bounce for the ounce. That's what they say here. Okay, one, two, three. Ah! Sure, the travel generation is informative. So, you finally made it to Chesky Budjohovich. You're all ready for the beauty of Chesky Kromola. But how do you get there? It's kind of tricky. From the main train station, you go under the street, you veer to the left, and head to the main bus terminal. Now, once you're here, what you want to do is check the signs, find out where you're going. In this case, we're going to Chesky Krumlov. Look at the timetable. You may find you have a couple minutes. And what I recommend, head over to the grill. You can get yourself a big old meaty hamburger, fries, and a drink for under two bucks. And I can only make this deal today. So come on down to the grill in Czech Republic. But more importantly, it's freaking fun. I've been healed. Feel the healing powers. Feel the healing powers of St. Jan. Yes, it's a miracle. Chesky Krumlov is a postcard just waiting to happen. We represent reality. <laughs> hey, now there's a concept. What to expect when you check your jet lag self in. And you know you're in a real high class joint when along with the checkout time it lists, if you need to throw up, please use the toilets. If not, you'll have to pay for the cleaning. Plus, we love taking it to the streets and talking to you, the traveler. Give me your take on Lucerne. It's really nice. It's a lot more green than where we come from. A lot more trees. You know what it is? It's the manure. You came to Prague for the, the tight skirts, the cheap beer. That's what I found. I came here because I heard the architecture is sweet. Oh, now he's, in case mom's watching. Oh, mother, I wanted to come and draw and follow my heart's desire in artiste. He's here for the skirts and the cheap beer. Swimming? Well, it's, the place is fed by a glacier, but we sort of discovered that after we jump in. But any time you have a glacier waterfall running into a big body of water, I'm thinking, you know, I'll never be able to have children. Trains are an important part of any European journey. Got a question? Ask the conductor. Here's a bathroom tip for you guys. When you're on a moving train, it's very important that you not only hold on to the handle, but also lean against the wall for leverage. Because a lot of times you'll hit some bumps and you get quite messy. With the leaning method, I come out clean and presentable. Without leaning, you come out less than presentable. In case your VCR's track has been on the blink, I'll recap. The travel generation is all about fun. Have you ever heard of Zanfir, master of the pan flute? Do you ever eat Captain Crunch cereal? Have you ever sat on your sofa in your it underwear in the seven. morning eating cornflakes? It is not a habit here. No. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Where's the pretty pictures? This is a travel show, isn't it? Well, hang on to your passport. We got them. Let's review. The travel generation delivers 30 minutes of two-stepping, crowd-diving, later hosen wearing fun. You don't have to be Bill Gates to travel. Our mission is to inspire 18 to 34s to get up and go global. Because to see the world is to expand the mind. And you don't want a bunch of dummies running around, do you? Okay, now some skinny dipping.